Hi, welcome to the first video of the Introduction to Time Series Analysis course. My name is David Madison. I'm a professor at Cornell University, and I'll help you master the basics of modeling and forecasting time series data. A time series is a sequence of data in chronological order. It is very common for any type of data to be recorded sequentially or over time. We find time series data everywhere, and especially in financial and economic applications. Examples include the daily log return on a stock, such as BMW, or monthly values of the Consumer Price Index, or CPI, which is a measure of the national inflation rate. Time series data is dated or time-stamped. The print function will display time series data along with this date information. It may be organized as a long list, as we have for the BMW stock data, or as a table, as we have for the CPI data. The plot function can be used to make a basic time series plot. The defining feature is that time is indexed on the horizontal axis, and the observations are shown from the first on the left to the last on the right. A line is commonly added to connect neighboring observations to improve interpretability and to emphasize any trends or patterns. Throughout this course, you will not only be learning how to use R for time series analysis and forecasting, you will also learn several models for time series data. These include the white noise, random walk, autoregression, and simple moving average models. Let's get started.